Is it going to be a good day? I hope so. getting spring out there we got some decent temperatures weather's going to be up and down this month but we're getting there snow's starting to melt so it's time to put uh, the back end of this back together anyways still waiting for the uh, the ICU the Dynatech once we get that then uh, hopefully that's it for this thing I'm just putting the uh, the harness back together. I changed out one of the uh, shrink wraps and I also noticed that now I get a closer look at this this is all this is all gray mono silicone like I don't understand somebody tried to mono everything or silicone everything but the uh, like I said, I changed out one of the shrink wraps and I put uh, dielectric grease in there and I'm taping it up and then I'll put a protective cover on it and hopefully that'll be good. I messed that one up pretty good. that up all right taped up got the dielectric grease in it it's really hard to put the uh, tape on <laughs> with the dielectric grease you gotta try not to get it on the tape you're putting on scraped off most of the, uh, the caulking that was there Cleaned it up a little bit. I'll see if I can put some kind of protective coating on there or protective thing on there. All right, put a little bit of spiral wrap on there. That'll make sure the tape doesn't unravel and it'll make some protection there. So that should do good. Now I can uh, fit the back plastic back on and the rack. Put this all back together. Attach all the uh, leads to the winch, the battery, put that piece back on, and then we'll be ready for the uh, Dynatech. And what I'm doing with the plastic now is I'm just uh, taking the uh, push pins that I had. I had a whole pile for the, the old Can-M. I'm just putting them in. These screws are, as these screws come out, I'm just putting the push, push pins back in. It's easier to take things apart instead of pulling screws out all the time.
only four bolts to hold the rack on, which is good. All right, the rear plastic is back on, held on with the push pins at the bottom, screws at the top, two bolts for the rack, the spacer, and at the back, there's two bolts there and there, my nice brand new light with an LED light bulb, it's pretty bright. You got uh, two bolts here for the plastic also. So that's not too bad. That works pretty good. And the crappy box that they gave me, at least I can make it work and hold some of my garbage in here. Might even be able to put a chainsaw in there. everything now. Now I'm going to search for bolts. Alright. All together now. Now we're just waiting for the Dynatech CDI and we'll be testing her out. So stay tuned when I get the CDI. I'm supposed to get it tomorrow. So hopefully, hopefully it comes and we get a little bit of nice weather to uh, test it in. All right. Is it going to be a good day? I hope so. It's here. Hopefully it works and that's it. Let's see if it goes in here. Yeah, it actually fits in there. Nice. Sort of. Okay, let's see what happens.
Don't look good.